undisputed era. Last week, Adam, you said, please, please come see me face to face. Come back to the arena that I was kicked out of. I'm here. Okay. And I brought 28 years of NFL experience with me because I knew you better than you know yourself. I know that you go nowhere without these three stooges. I know that you would be nothing without these three stooges. And I know that you could never handle a face-to-face -face with a human like moi all by yourself. Man. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, yeah, Adam Cole telling them to leave. You ready to start now, Pat? You got McAfee. And his boys leave. Do you remember what happened two weeks ago when you and I were in this same NXT arena, Adam Cole? You probably don't. This is how it ended. I'll remind you. Shawn Michaels was checking for vitals on your soulless body right over yonder next <laughs> to stupid Tom Phillips. Oh. Last week, you go on this entire rant about how you were being held back. That I took advantage of a situation. Blah, blah, blah. I outsmarted you in your own house. This is some good microphone work, guys. Business, I, I, I was expecting you. this of Pat. I hope he lives up to it in the ring. Then you went on an entire rant about how I'm not special. Not special. You're the longest reigning NXT champ. You've wrestled all around this globe. You've wrestled in front of five people at armories, bingo halls, high schools, Japan, all over the world, and you got to here and you were the biggest star in this brand. In this What'd brand. What'd you call yourself? The king of NXT? You had all these people fooled. 400 and some days you were undefeated. Took me a minute and a half to knock your ass out. One minute. Oh, knock your ass out. One swing of this foot. Boom. Done. Then you call me not special. How's that not special? I've never been in this ring before. Made you look amateur. I've made a million dollars in seven different professions. And you, especially you, stupid you, Mustache stooge in the ignorant wrestling community at home. You better hope that I don't stick with this profession. Oh, this will be the ignorant eight wrestling community, the IWC. And on Saturday, Saturday, Shots fired. It's going to end the same exact way that it ended two weeks ago. You're going to be left unconscious after probably throwing a temper tantrum, after losing your mind, after losing your cool, because you and I are different level humans. You only gave me two weeks to train for this match. Two weeks! Triple H gets on ESPN, the cerebral assassin who kicked me out, who says, well, if Pat wants to be tough, I can make him famous. Two weeks is all I'm going to need to beat you. And you're going to have to explain to the entire wrestling community. Welcome to wrestling, how you Pat. you lost to an outsider. Let me tell you how you lost Ooh, to an outsider. That's the because hook. That's the hook. In this world, you are. But I am next level. I am above you as a human. I am above you as an athlete. And on Saturday, it's going to end with one swing of his foot, meeting your face, sending it to the moon, and the only sound that any of these idiots in here and anybody at home will hear is boom. Oh, oh, oh yeah! Boom!
Oh, oh, Adam Cole laying him out. Security getting tossed out here. Oh, big boot right there. All four men super kicked down. They all go. Oh, yeah. And that's the wake up call for Pat McAfee. Stare him down, AC. Now he's got his boys. Now his boys get in the ring. Adam Cole's boys. Undisputed air. Holy crap, I'm in. Pat's got to back out, right? Pat's got to back out. You've got us hooked. You want us to see this fight, right? WWE, you've got us hooked. Get packed to back out. This Saturday at TakeOver, I'm going to make you my bitch. <laughs> oh, sh sugar honey, iced tea. Oh my God. I'm ready. So. That was so good.